but I'm going to show you how to strip down a Lumar Ocean winch. These are some of the spares you may require to start your service. You might need a brush, oil, Lumar grease, some spare bearings, springs, pulls and possibly collets. Firstly I'm going to strip down the winch. To do this we spin the top off. This should have only been fitted hand tight so it should be easy to undo. Remove the feeder arm. Remove the collets. These collets are holding in the centre spindle and are located in this groove in the centre spindle when, on, when reassembling. Remove all the drum. Remove two bearings and the lower washer. Then we're going to remove the gear stacks by removing this pin. And this spindle here. Now I'm going to strip the gear packs down. Each gear stack holds two pulls. And they're located in position by a spring which is easy removable. Now the winch is apart, we now need to degrease. You can use uh, diesel, paraffin, white spirits, or any uh, degreaser available from your hardware stores. Uh, gasoline or petrol is not recommended. You then now put the parts into a wash and degrease. Now it's been degreased, we now need to reset the pool and the spring. To do this, put the pool leg against the flat face, squeeze the spring, hold the pool up, and insert. Now we're going to reassemble the winch. We're going to regrease and service and check for wear on components. The pools are only oiled. and we grease everywhere else. Check this bearing is correct, not loose fit, change is necessary. Reinsert the gear package back into the centre stem, lightly grease the base, where the gear touches the centre stem. Replace the spindle, lightly greasing. There's the same for the other gear package. Lightly oil the pause. Check the bearings are correct. And lightly grease. Replace the spindle on this one. We're now going to replace the centre spindle. Light grease the gear and the spindle itself. At this stage you can put a winch handle in. We're now going to grease the gears by rotating the winch handle. Now remove the winch handle. Uh, fit the flat washer. In the centre there is a chamfer. This must go downwards as it takes out the cutout of the centre stem. Replace the bearings by greasing. Now we replace the drum. 
lightly grease inside here and on where the drum bearings are. Now we can replace the collets. Check the collets for wear and lightly grease. You may need to lift the centre spindle slightly just to reinsert the collets. Now we fit the uh, feeder arm, making sure the stripper ring is located in the back of the feeder arm. I like to grease the O-cell here as this helps keep the tack top cat on. Spin the top on hand tight only. That's the winch service complete. Lumar reckons that, recommends that the uh, winch service should take place once a year uh, to make a good clean winch. You can download the manual off the website which has full details of the items used and replacement parts are available from lumar.com.